What really made me go into research was my dad. Uh, he had um, coronary artery disease and he suffered through two or three heart attacks. He had three open heart surgeries. Uh, absolutely amazing what he had to go through. And I watched him and said, you know, there's got to be something that we could do. And I saw so many people in our family that suffered from diabetes, heart attacks, all these types of problems that plague us in the Southeast especially. And so actually that's why I went into research. And that's why I'm a cardiovascular researcher. Because I think I was trying to, and I often say this, it's kind of embarrassing, many of the things that I study in my own research program I suffer from myself, so sometimes I say I'm just trying to save myself in some ways, but I think it, it is, like I see, I see in myself what I see all these other people having to go through, and so I guess, you know, I, I, do, I do believe that people do research because they want to help things and make a difference there. So I think that's what brought me into it. You know, for me, really, it was my mentors during graduate school and my postdoctoral experiences, those mentors. I, I was really lucky to work with some great people. They were great scientists, but they were, more importantly, good people. They, they taught me not just how to do an experiment, but, you know, the importance of ethics behind your science and everything to do with that. I love to sing, actually. I sing in my church choir. So that's something that makes me feel good uh, all the way from my soul to just, you know, whatever. Um, and so I really like that. And I sing, I especially like it because my daughter sings in the same choir. So I get to, you know, look over and see her face singing back at me. I mean, it's simple. I, I went to, uh, you know, it's I, my parents took us to Myrtle Beach, I think, every year when I was a kid for so many years. And I, you know, I guess you're a product of your <laughs> upbringing. So I've been taking my children there since they were little kids. Not every year, but we go maybe every three to four years. They love going there. They know everything there. Um, and it's just relaxing because we know everything. So it's not really work, you know, to, to be on vacation. It's just pure relaxation. Research still motivates me. It's still the thing that, it's like, I don't know, it's almost like a virus or something. You, you start doing research and you follow some question and you let it take you where it takes you. And it's actually the most fun thing. I think about it, I swear I do, in the shower. I think about it when I'm driving to work. Um, if I get the opportunity to walk, which I don't very often these days, that's what I'm doing. I'm thinking about, I solve something. I figure something out. So to me, it's still uh, probably what gets me up and gets me here. Uh, and I'm very fortunate to still have some time to devote to research while still trying to do what I need to do as the Vice President for Research. So it's great.